Hey YouTube, what's up? It's Tom from TJCSTech.com here. How are you guys doing in this video today? I'm going to be giving you guys a quick video with anything and everything you need to know regarding Apple's media event slash press conference that they hosted earlier today where they released the brand new next generation iPad model. Also, besides the in-depth overview, quick rundown, and my first and final initial impressions, I want to also say that this video is brought to you by TechShade. For more information on TechShade, please visit TechShade.net and the other links in the video description below. So now without further ado and rambling, let's get started with the main purpose of this video. So today, March 7th, 2012, Apple held a live keynote where they unveiled the next generation iPad model. Here's a quick overview of what the device contains in its core contents, technology specifications, such feature-wise. The new iPad contains a retina display of 2048 by 1536 or 3.1 million pixels or 264 ppi. It has 4G LTE with 21 megabits per second personal hotspot access and a DC HSDPA at 42 megabits per second and LTE at 73 megabits per second. LTE is available on both Verizon and AT&T plus Rogers, Bell, and TELUS. It contains an A5X processor with quad-core graphics. Yes, it has a home button. The camera has been upgraded, pulling in optics from the iPhone 4S, including a 5 megapixel rear illuminated sensor, 5 element lens, IR filter, and ISP built into the A5X chip, auto exposure, auto focus, white balance, face detection, stabilization, and of course, still has a 480p video capture. Siri did not come to the new iPad as it was expected to previously, but there is a new voice dictation feature via a microphone button on the keyboard which supports US English, British, Australian, French, German, and Japanese languages. Hotspot, yes, if the carrier supports it as previously stated. The battery life retains 10 hours of battery life, 9 hours on 4G LTE. The size of the iPad 3 of the new iPad is 9.4 millimeters thin, weighing 1.4 pounds. The price of the iPad 3, just note uh, the price of the new iPad slash iPad 3 is $499 for the 16 gigabyte model, $599 for the 32 gigabyte model, and $699 for the 64 bit gigabyte model. These are just the prices for the, the Wi Fi only versions, but not the actual. 4G LTE models, but the prices could vary up to those. I kind of know the prices of them, but I forgot them, so the links to everything will be in the video description below, along with the full features and price ranges for everything. And the availability for the iPad and the new iPad device will be starting on March 16th. You can now actually buy it in stores on March 16th, but the pre-orders start today in the U.S., Canada, United Kingdom, France, Germany, Switzerland, and Japan. So that pretty much sums up everything feature-wise. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I did say in the beginning that I was going to actually give my first and final initial impressions, but I decided to shorten this video up and extend another video and on TJC's tech to dedicate to giving you guys my first and final initial impressions. So if you want to check out that video after I create, the link will be in the video description below. Make sure to follow me on Twitter at twitter.com slash Tom of Action, Facebook.com slash Thomas E. You can subscribe to me there via Facebook. And everything else will be in the video description below as well. So I'll see you guys later. Peace.